Hi everyone, you welcome to my channel. My name is Drastable and today I'm going to show you how to create fade in or fade out automation on the master boss inside machine 2.0 and above. It's very simple. It doesn't take a lot of time to do this at all. All right. Anyway, let's first of all listen to the track we're going to be working on. Now what we need to do is to create a new group over here. Well, let's go ahead and name it. Fade Effect Enter. Right. So over here. We're going to choose any plugin, which we're not going to use anyway. And of course, if you want to, you can, but I'm not going to use it. So I'm going to go ahead and put it off right after, you know, yeah. So click here to choose group, go here to open the mixer. And guys, this is where most of the work lies. For the sake of this tutorial, I have only two groups and the one we just created, which is the fade effect. We're not going to touch it. Guys, we are not going to touch it. Just leave it the way it is. Okay, come here, click on it and find the fade effect we created. And click it, choose it here too. Bam. All right, click here to go back. And of course, choose the sound. And this mark here, I don't know the name. Just click it. And here, make sure you choose the output. If for any reason it happens to be like this or that, always choose output. And you know, we have these uh, three options, audio, aux, and MIDI. Don't choose any of these two. Just choose audio. Go here to the group and choose master. Guys, don't choose any other thing apart from master. If you choose this or that, mm -mm, it's not going to work. Choose this. But now we are done. You can automate your fade in or fade out automation. Yeah. Let me just try this. You see it? And fade out, I mean fade in. And fade out. We fading out. <laughs> it's all good, it's all good. In order for the effect to be part of your project or your track, then of course you need to automate, which I'm going to do very soon. Um, but um, I got a little problem. The problem is when machine hardware knobs is not in good shape, you know what I'm saying? So no matter what, I'm going to be using the mouse, which is going to make the work very hard for me. Okay. So I have discovered another uh, different technique, you know what I'm saying? All right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy this by um, holding control and drag it here yeah to copy you know what i'm saying if you want to use this stuck i mean if you want to use this technique you okay man you can use it if you want but if your machine hardware is working fine you don't need to okay so the reason is anyway uh, let me delete this yeah you see this there's a little bit of silence for me at the beginning of the track so um when i press play i'm gonna get some little some few seconds to prepare for the automation okay yeah so let me go ahead and try it you know what i'm saying i don't want this video to take that long all right we're gonna gradually fade in yep yep 
yep, yep. Okay, we fade in right now. One time for your mind, we fade in. Yeah, we go. We fit in. Uh, yeah. Oh. And now. And now. We're going to fade out. Yeah. We're going to fade out. Okay. So this is how to create fade in or fade out automation on the master boss inside machine 2.0 and above if you like this video give me that thumbs up or subscribe thank you for watching my name is Drastable. i'm out of here peace